Hey everyone and welcome to Monster High Monday. Today I'm going to be opening up and sharing with you Honey Swap. And Honey Swap is from the brand new series uh, for a movie that's coming out, Fright's Camera Action. And she is the daughter of the Swap Monster. I have been wanting her just because of her hair. Her hair is pretty awesome, right? I picked her up at Target for only $19.99 and... Um, they're just starting to show up in the stores. Um, when I went, there's a ton of them. There wasn't just one or two on the shelf or anything else. There was a ton of them on the shelf. So they're just starting to show up in the stores. Um, the other place you can get them as Toys R Us are about $21.99 and Justice. They have them there for $36, but the best time to go is when they have a 50% off sale and you only pay like $18 for them. So yeah, she's a brand new doll and she goes to the series for the Frights Camera Action series because um, it's a new movie that's coming out this year. Oh, I'm excited to see it. I really am. Um, she's the last doll that I have purchased so far for this series here. I'm hoping to find more of them. Um, I have all the main dolls. Maybe the singles or something. But anyways, enough of me just jibber jabbering. This is what Honey Swamp looks like in the package. Very, very pretty. Gosh, I love the colors. <laughs> and this is the back of the package. Back of the package does say that she is 115 Swamp Monster years. Her monster parents are the Honey Island Swamp Monster. So it's not just the Swamp you know, the daughter of the Swamp Monster, it's the Honey Island Swamp Monster. So, <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and open her up, and I'll give you a closer look of what she looks like. I'm super excited to just touch her hair. I really am. So I'm going to open her up, and I'll give you a closer look of what she looks All like. Alright, so here is Honey Swamp. She is absolutely gorgeous. Her hair is just so much fun to play with. I, I, I just wanted to play with her hair so bad. It's kind of like a sponge... Um, don't play with it too much because you might make it like really frizzy, but it is super fun. Definitely. And it is kind of flat in the back, but that's because of the package. As you can see there. But it is really super fun. Now her dress is also very plain, but I absolutely love it. She has some fuzz that comes out from underneath her dress, which is really cool kind of would keep her warm <laughs> and on her little dress it has like little it's like cut in pieces there's flowers on them and the flowers have faces how cool is that and she does have the same flowers on her belt but they're hard to see and they do have faces as well she has on just one little bracelet and her whole body has these little designs all through them. Even underneath here, like on her belly, there's designs going all the way up. It's really neat. And her shoes, her shoes are little crocodiles. She's very pretty, like so pretty when you take her out of the package. Also she comes with her little journal, this is Honey Swamp on it. A, the stand that she is on does come with her, the black Monster High brush, a little recording camera, and this that goes cut, take two, take three, so this as well. This is Monster High right on it. So she's a great addition to the Monster High dolls. I think she fits in perfectly well. She's very gorgeous. Her hair, like I said, is probably like the best feature of her. Her dress is very different than anything I've seen. And she has all those designs on her. I mean, they put designs on her legs instead of painting them on. Um, which I really love. Because, you know, most cases they just you know, paint on designs on the legs or just like, um, Venus with Flytrap, they just have vines growing up her and they fall off. I like how they are, you know, on her this time where it's something that can't fall off. So it's really cool. 
but she's very pretty and I just want to mention her eyes are kind of um, reptilian as well they're really kind of freaky <laughs> but I want to thank you all for watching make sure you comment rate and subscribe that's if you want to and as well as check out my Instagram my Facebook page and my Twitter I do update that uh, you know, pretty much every day. And if you would like to send me any fan mail, send it to the Crazy Pony Lady, P.O. Box 9, Spencer, Mass, 01562, and that's in the USA. So, yeah, look forward to more Monster High Mondays in the future. Bye, everyone. Bye. Cut!